So when I started my business search, I developed 10 criteria to evaluate all a variety of different ventures. And as I ran those ventures through uh, my 10 criteria, the one uh, business that continued to pop up that met all 10 criteria was units. Some of the characteristics that helped me decide to get into units were low employees, specifically having a good manager already so that I could focus my, my energy into growing the business, scaling, and marketing, which I enjoy a lot. Good margins. I was always used to razor thin margins in the steel commodities business and units is more noble that way. Some of those criterias were first and foremost a high barrier to entry. So we didn't want everyone to just be able to plop down $20,000 and set up shop next door to us. So we wanted to make sure it was a highly capitalized business. Um, and that was one of the criteria that we used. I finally came around to choosing units over other opportunities was that it's a very simple business model. I actually like playing with toys. I like forklifts. I like trucks. I like uh, doing things like that. I don't mind getting my hands dirty and getting out in the warehouse. In the last eight years, uh, we have seen great support. Uh, from units corporate, whether it be on new product, uh, engineering, uh, the day-to-day -day operations, uh, they've, they've just been wonderful. The support's always there. You know, units corporate and the units team have been a big help for us, especially early on. You know, when we came into this business, we had no knowledge of the portable storage industry. And so it was all new and the support um, from uh, the uh, Units Corporate uh, Organization was extremely beneficial. Experiences with Units Corporate have been outstanding. They've, the one person I was talking to, an individual who had trained me, I typically spoke to at 7 a.m. and 7 p.m., so he was always reachable. Uh, the other support team has been great as well and reachable, returns calls if I don't reach them right away. They've been outstanding. So I have had to rely heavily on the unit's uh, staff and expertise. So to be able to catch up on 15 years, 20 years of experience and expertise has, has helped someone with my background tremendously. My relationship with the unit's corporate staff is great. I think that they're always accessible. Um, there's never been a time uh, that I've had to, I guess, ever felt like I was an island by myself. One of the best parts of the unit's organization is our relationships with the other franchisees. As the Franchise uh, Association president, I get to come in contact with a lot of the franchisees and actually I reach out to, uh, to all of them. I think what really adds value for me and is the ability to access other franchisees in the system because, uh, and, you know, best practices, what challenges they're facing, how do they overcome those hurdles. I lean on the other franchisees all the time. Uh, you know, it's, it's good for me to be able to call, call others that have been doing this longer than me and, and get some advice and expertise. Yeah, so my experience with all the other franchise owners has been phenomenal. I've found that it really is a team environment where everybody's willing to support each other, share best practices, uh, talk about you know, successes and failures that they've had, workarounds with some of the, the B2B customers that they've had. Uh, so overall, it's been phenomenal. They've, it's, it's really been an open network in terms of, of sharing. So I've, I've had great experiences with them all, actually. Donna and I have been a units franchisee for 11 full years. We were one of the early birds and uh, we came in in 2008 when we purchased the territory. Choosing units was challenging and difficult in terms of the capital outlay initially, but when you have to, you have to look at it and be willing to take a risk and look at the long term and you can see what can happen in years three, four, five, six. So right now I'm still near the top of the learning curve, but it's exciting to see where this can go and how I can grow. And it, I also get the opportunity to challenge myself, get out of my comfort zone, and see what my true potential really is as well. The model is a very simple model uh, at, at units. There's, uh, with my franchise, I just have myself, 
uh, my brother who's a co-owner with me and two drivers. So it's not like we have a lot of employees, it's just the four of us and there's not a lot of staff, there's not a lot of interactions that uh, are a lot of overhead, it's just delivering containers, it's a very simple model. I love the ethical values that the corporation has. They mimic a lot of what I think uh, should happen in business and how I want to lead my life. So it's been a great match for me and I'm very happy to see, um, again, the moral and values that Units Corporation has. What we found is, is the Units family uh, works together to make sure that uh, everybody knows uh, what works, uh, best practices, uh, and uh, Units Corporate fosters that relationship. Some of the attributes about the unit's business model is the convenience. Again, offering the customer what they want. So we can bring a unit to them, they can take their time loading it up, they can keep it at their location, or we can bring it back to ours for them. As my wife tells me, uh, this is the happiest I've been in 25 years of my career. It feels so good to be uh, independent and to have a business that I can believe in uh, and grow uh, for the next 10 plus years.